Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. My name is Savannah if you are new here and today we are continuing our legacy challenge. I'm excited. I'm very excited because um, I always say this in the beginning of the videos that we're going to be doing a bunch of stuff and then we only end up doing like one of those things. But we are going to be doing a lot in this one. Um, we're going to be moving out Stella and most of the kids. Which is really sad. It's going to be an empty household besides Zoe and Ren, I believe. Yeah. Crazy. It's going to be nice, though. Um, we'll be able to focus more on them and, like, not have to worry about the stress and just taking care of eight sims. No, nine sims. How many do we have? Yeah, nine sims. Oh, my God. I've been doing that for so long, and honestly, I'm so over it. <laughs> I'm over it! So yeah, gonna be doing that today and then we're just gonna focus on Zoe and just get some stuff done, you know? Because that's the whole point of this challenge is to get stuff done. So, I don't have a Celsius today. I have a watermelon Red Bull. This even matches my outfit. One of my friends told me that I should mix watermelon Red Bull with orange juice and so I had a cup of that this morning. It was really good. So I'm just gonna finish off the Red Bull with what I have left. And um, yeah, so I'm sorry, no, no ASMR today. But if you have a drink, cheers, cheers to you, cheers to this video, I'm so excited to be filming today. And uh, I think that's all I gotta say, so let's get into it, cheers. Okay, you guys, so we're gonna be starting off in cast today. I gave Zoe a new look and I wanted to show y'all what I did. <laughs> I hope that you like it, I'm obsessed. I'm obsessed with her. I don't think you guys understand. She is just... She's iconic. She's like Sabrina the Teenage Witch. <laughs> uh, but I did give her a new hair. I gave her some bangs and I changed up her glasses. Uh, I think that's all I did on her head. I didn't add any makeup or new brows or anything. But I hope that you guys like the bangs. I thought they were really cute. So this is her first outfit. I gave her a bunch. So bear with me. <laughs> Here's her second one. Ah, so cute. I want this in real life. Oh my God, she looks so good. Okay. Here's the third one again. So freaking cute. It makes me like angry a little bit. <laughs> Here's her fourth one. Also very cute. As you guys can see, it's, it's like kind of like the same style. Um, I don't even really know what you would call it, but you get the vibe, you get the vibe. And here's her fifth one, it's really cute too. I normally don't, I don't, I don't mess around with bell bottoms, but I thought they looked pretty good on her. And here is her formal wear, super cute. Here's her athletic wear. This is so cool. This is by, uh, I wanna say Ellie Simple. Yes, Ellie Simple, super dope. And she's got her Yeezys on. <laughs> Uh, here's her sleepwear. I know I didn't use the full body outfit. Like, I'm I'm even shocked, but I thought this was cute. Thought I'd change it up. Here's her party wear. I love this dress so much. She looks like a freaking go-go girl or whatever they're called. I don't even know, but I'm obsessed. Here's her swim. Super cute, too. She is so unbelievably ripped. Here's her hot weather outfits. This is so cute. It looks very comfortable. I'm, I'm obsessed. Here's her second hot wear outfit. Darling, stop flailing. Thank you. Uh, here is her cold weather. This is really cute. Also super cute. I don't even know. I want to cry. These outfits make me want to cry, you guys. Ah, I spent like a couple hours this morning just in cast and it was so fun. And um, yeah, I my class got canceled today, so. Yeah, I had time to, to, to do this, and I'm so happy. Um, I also gave Leslie a new look, too. I gave her a new hair. Um, I just made her look a little bit more um, grown up because she she is quite grown up now. Let me show you her, um, her everyday wear. She's pretty active, so I wanted to, like, keep her in semi-active wear, I guess. Really love this hair. Super cute. I'm obsessed with her. So she, she's got a little update. And then I think that's it. I don't think I updated any, anyone else. I gave Marnie like her hot weather and cold weather outfits, but we saw her makeover in the last video. I love her so much. Okay, so let's have a look at the calendar. 
we've got air day today, which means that we just have to do everything that the previous heirs let loved to do, which should be fine because we garden and game pretty much every day. <laughs> uh, tomorrow we've got nothing, and then the next day we have Halloween, which is fun. Oh, and we have a birthday, Ophelia. <gasps> Ooh, that's so exciting. Ooh. Halloween on Ophelia's birthday. Okay, we'll probably have to have a party, right? I would assume. <laughs> and then a couple days after that, we've got freaking Zoe's birthday. Oh no! They grow up too fast. They do. All right, so Stella, in order to move you out, I'm trying to max your career. So you just need to be promoted one more time. You have work in two days. Oh, we have a breakthrough. Thank goodness, we need a bunch of those, don't we? Oh God, yeah, we need five more, okay. Um, and I don't really want to tinker, like make Zoe tinker because she died in the last episode. I totally forgot about that. I don't want that to happen again. <laughs> uh, with Ren, what were we doing? You have a audition today, okay. Um, and then for your skill, we were doing knitting. So why don't you like knit some? You feel like knitting? Let's do a black and white bear beanie. With Leslie, why can't I, hello? Whew. Oh my god, I thought my game just broke. <laughs> With Leslie, uh, I forgot that I had given her a job. A uh, engineer. I don't know why I picked that. Why did I pick that? Oh, right. Oh, you know what, you guys? Hold on. Now that Marnie is a teen, we don't have to worry about moving in Leslie with them because... She's a teen, so we're all good there. So Leslie can move into Salvadorado with Alice at some point. I still need to figure out how to do that, but that's gonna happen. And then in the last episode as well, I think Loey and, Loey? Oh, that's such a cute couple name, Loey. <laughs> I think Zoe and Lamar um, made it official, yeah? Yeah, they're boyfriend and girlfriend. Um, awesome. We could probably make him a doctor though. So he could be a scientist and he could be a doctor. I think that would be pretty cool. She's gonna make some cheddar popcorn. Delicious. <laughs> so, uh, what should we do? What should we do? I really want you to go to work, but you won't, I don't think you'll get promoted if you're, if you're not scheduled, which is really annoying. So why don't you just come outside and like, super sell this stuff so we can have more money. I can't believe we, we almost have $4 million and we started with nothing. That blows my mind. That blows my freaking mind. And I love how you can like retract the holiday thing now. That's so nice. <gasps> Did you just, is knitting a five, a fiver? Oh, it's not, it's a tenner. Oh, okay, okay. I thought it was a fiver. Yo, if this hurts your head, sir, why don't you just, it's not even on. What are you complaining about? Not the clay again. Why is this happening? Oh boy. Oh boy, oh boy, oh boy, oh boy, oh boy. All I wanna do is focus on Zoe. I have a feeling I'm not the only one. <laughs> she is so cute. It's not fair. You know what? She can retire early. Do you know how exciting that is? Since we are already level seven, you know? This girl can freaking retire. Who's this? What's your name? Hold up. Stop right there. Not sure what's your name? What's your name? What's your name? Bridget Middleton? Do we need a best friend? Do we already have one? Oh my God, I forgot Luna's pregnant too. <gasps> Hopefully we get to see her babies today. How exciting will that be? Do you have a best friend, Zoe? You have your friend group, but I don't think you have a bestie well who should be our bestie then should we have a boy bestie or a girl bestie should rank <laughs> rungi be our bestie or do i really want to subject myself to mispronouncing his name every single time reagan reagan fire wait hold up does she marry a fire or has she always been a fire is jocelyn our bestie no what are your traits reagan She's in our friends club. I'm thinking Reagan should probably be our bestie then. She's freaking beautiful and I love her style. Yeah, we'll hang out with her. We'll hang out with her. We'll like, we'll get that going. But right now I wanna get Zoe to just focus on her, uh, her breakthroughs. Wait, who's that? Hold on, quick pause. <laughs> Who are you, sir? 
Johnny Ferguson. Let's have a look at you, Johnny. Look at you, you're so fit. Oh my gosh. Oh, wow. Uh-oh. <laughs> no, 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 no. We just got into a relationship with Lamar. No. And they're so good together. Like, they're perfect together. They are. <laughs> Lord help me. Oh, speak of the dev, bro. He wants to go on a date? I mean, yeah, let's go. I'm down. We're not really doing anything right now. We're kind of just waiting for uh, Stella to get promoted and for Halloween to roll around. That's it. You know what would be so cool? If there was a potion that was like instant promotion. Or no, a potion. A potion that was like instant promotion, you know? He invited us to Hare and Hedgehog. All right. We're not feeling very good, so I'm gonna have her have a potion of Plentiful Needies. Just have that, make yourself feel better. Is that Melly? Oh no! What happened to your skin tone? And <laughs> your last name is Ramirez now. Anyway, are you an elder? You are, Jimmy Genderbend, huh? Jimmy, you ain't bad looking for an elder, I'll tell you what. Oh god, he's talking to us about woohoo. Have we woo- Ah! There's um- Oh god, who was this again? I think that's one of your guys' sims. Oh man, we gotta introduce ourselves. She is so freaking cool. What is this? What are you doing? Hi, I'm Zoe. I like your style. Okay, okay. What's the first impression that you got? Uh, admirable? Okay, Zoe thinks that Jordan is admirable. Same. And then she thinks that we're proper and polite. I think it's because of the, the introduction that we did. Yaleg! Look at Lamar looking at her. He loves us. He absolutely does. Oh, did she just compliment us? Well, thanks, girl. Right back at you, TBH. What kind of magic can we do? Oh my god, we could light the coffee bar on fire. <laughs> Sheesh. Carrie! <laughs> Aw, they're cute. She's giving us a dirty look, though. Honey, introduce, introduce yourself. Dag Dag! I forgot how high of a voice she has. I want Zoe to have like a massive friend group. I think that would be fun. Oh my gosh, Melissa, you're pregnant. <laughs> Who's this? Martin Genderbend? So many Genderbends. Aw, he's pretty cute. Yo, this place poppin'. Oh my god, Felix! <laughs> Hi! Oh my gosh, and this is the girl from um from my uh my uh was this a random random generator sim? Oh my gosh, there's so many sims here. It's exciting. I'm gonna wait till this date is over and then we're gonna head over to Luna's house because I really wanna see if she, um, don't call me ever. Okay, no. Oh, we're fine. We're fine, we're fine. We're fine, we're fine, we're fine. Let's just, let's just embrace him really quick. Oh gosh, he's leaving. He's really mad. Is it because we were talking to everyone else but you? Oh, okay. Sorry, Lamar. We'll make it up to you later, I guess. There was just so many people. Right, where does Luna live again? Samai Shuno? Oh no, she's still pregnant, okay. All right, we'll go check uh, later on um, in the day. Okay, we're back. We're back, and Ren failed her audition. Oh my God. How many auditions are you gonna fail? Seriously, you're like making such a bad reputation for yourself. Ooh, Treasure of Arbyville? How come I've never seen that before? All right, who made a mess? Uh, so Marnie is an art lover and she loves the outdoors, so, uh, maybe we can work on painting? Maybe she can, like, paint outside? I think that would be cute. Should we get her an easel? Let's get her an easel. Why don't you come out here, start working on that. Let's just do a classic painting. Yay, another breakthrough! Thank goodness. Aw, little baby's hungry. Why don't you come here and have some? Oh my god, let's get a delivery. I haven't done that yet. Uh, let's do Zoomer's food delivery. Let's get a poke bowl. 
<laughs> just one, just one for, for little Rotheo. How cute. Oh, are you done? Why is this always The Sims' first painting? Four more breakthroughs. You got this. You got work in 11 hours. I doubt we're gonna get it, but <gasps> Alice is here. Hold up. Did you graduate? It says that you have no home. Interesting. Very interesting. But uh, hey, Leslie, can you get up and like get to know her a little bit? Because you guys are gonna be living together. So you should probably be friends. Oh, oh, Charles is here. Oh, why are you so sad from losing a friend? Oh man, share techie tips. Oh, she's happy to see Max, that's cute. Why are you guys talking to each other so far away? Stop being weird. So in case you guys forgot, the reason why I wanna move in Le Leslie with Alice and Salvadorada is because she got the Jungle Explorer aspiration. Cute, they got a sentiment, I love it. I can ask her about her degree. So that means that she has it, right? No one was around, so we left. Where? Oh, she does. She has a history degree. Okay, that means we have to give her her. Oh, wow. Seriously? Poll? Really? Cool. <laughs> Where did he leave the food? What, what do you mean no one was around? Literally, everyone is here. Oh. Nice dress. Rock and roll. Come get your meal. Or did you already eat? You already ate? Oh my god, those. You know what? Give your brother your meal. Since you already ate. <laughs> Hi, everybody! Hi, Dr. Nick! Air day successful. Air day is over. Air day is over. Air day was awful. Oh my god, I thought I... Pretty much everyone had a successful one. Oh, I want you to, um, paint some more. You're feeling inspired still, so... Come on here. Sell. I want the sun to come up so she can paint from reference. Yay, 11th breakthrough. Let's freaking go, dude. We're almost there. Ah! Fang you very much for laughing at my puns. Y'all are silly. Yeah, girl, get them breakthroughs. Let's get it. Bye, Alice. Thank you for coming to say hello. Oh, Stella has a talent point. You guys. The last one. What? This girl is powerful. We didn't get anything for it. Nothing. No achievement. No nothing. For doing this whole thing. Wow. Whatever, dude. She needs to learn one more spell in practical magic. I really want to know what it is. Maybe I should get her to practice. Charlie's here, he's gonna say hi to her. Are you gonna say hi to her? Oh, he's gonna grill, okay. Not the freaking wellness concoction. You know what this reminds me of? Cheaper by the dozen. It has those vibes. <laughs> when they all go to school together at the same time. It's funny. She's got work in 30 minutes, so she just needs two more breakthroughs. That's so annoying. We're just gonna have to wait another day. It's fine. She keeps breaking this thing. Boss's birthday. Zoe wants to get her boss a birthday present but can't leave work to buy it. How should she go about it? That's tough. Let's make it. Oh, we got a small performance gain. Uh, her boss walks up, inquires, and is delighted by the gesture. Zoe is able to step away with a good feeling of effort. Direct from the birthday boss. Okay, cool. I had a feeling that if we chose like, oh, just do it online, that it like wouldn't come in time or something stupid like that. Stella, you got zapped. Take a shower. Or did you get zapped? Did you already shower? When do you die? Oh, you got time. You're good, you're good. Oh my God, Luna is here and she's so pregnant. Holy crap. Oh, wow. I think this is the first time um, Stella is seeing Luna like this. Okay, we gotta get a pic of mama uh, feeling the belly. Come on, oldie. Uh-oh, she, she, she's leaving. Okay, goodbye. You gotta go pee, that's fine. But I'm trying to feel your belly, you know? Those are my grandchildren in there. Speaking of grandchildren, I wonder how Felix's kids are doing. 
Do you even know them? You do. Okay, maybe we should um, have them come over. Welcome back, everybody. Everyone has a freaking school project. <sighs> oh, freak is your name. Oh, freak is your name. Hold me compost, we'll be right over. Love to hear it. Yes, come have a play date with your cousins. Oh, Rothio, you poor baby. Come on, let's get you to bed. He's here. Hi, little one. Oh, you're so cute. Hello. Welcome to Gam Gam's house. Maybe I should make some cookies. Why? Every time I try to take a freaking picture, there's a pole in the way. All right. Let's make some cookies. I don't know why William didn't end up coming over. Oh, he is here. He's just not as social. That's fair. <laughs> All right. Let's make some cookies for the grandkids. It's so weird how we have grandkids that are the same age as our, like, act or our, our kids. That is weird. So weird. Ren, you have been in this outfit this whole time. Why? What are you doing, little babe? Hi! We haven't seen you at all this episode. You're feeling good. Uh, you're a little stressed from school. Sorry to hear that. You're a little hungry, but cookies are being made. Help is on the way. Why don't you come say hi to your cousin? Do you know each other? You do. Wait, not your cousin. Niece? Nephew? Oh my gosh. Nephew. <laughs> Interesting. Welcome back, Leslie. How was work? Gosh, you need a potion. Let's get you one, shall we? Yay, she made the cookies. All right, call to meal. Uh, Bellamy likes jazz? Why does that suit him so much? <laughs> that is so cute. Bellamy, why are you so sensitive to everything? Come say hi to your, your nephew. Dude, Ren, you failed another audition? I, I don't even know what to say at this point. She's just not going to them. Okay, she's back. She didn't get a promotion because she didn't get those breakthroughs. That's infuriating. Who are you? I like your outfit, Courtney. Do you want to hang out tonight? Well, it depends. What you trying to do? A nightclub, huh? I've been meaning to give this Elizabeth person a makeover, so yeah, let's go. Let's go. Because right now, I'm kind of just waiting for Stella to go to work so that she can get a promotion, so it's just like a lot of time killing. I'm obsessed with her. Look at her. Just look at her! Let's get that freaking screenshot going, yeah? She looks like a Disney princess. <laughs> Okay, so this is that one girl that we met when we were at, in the realm of magic that one time and I was like, oh my god, she is so cool looking. She is in our, um, our conjuring club. Um, so I'm gonna hop in a cast really quick and give her a very fast makeover. Oh, she's a writer. That's so cute. Oh, and she has kids. Hold up. What is happening? So she has a sister and two sons, Cliff and Jordan. She is mean, a glutton, and self-absorbed. And she just wants a big house. That is what she strives for in life. And she's a spellcaster. She's loaded. Like, her personality is very loaded. <laughs> she's beautiful, I'll give her that. You know who she looks like? If you guys watch Claire Witch Baby on Twitch, she looks like her a little bit. Okay, I'm gonna do this one. It's very, very similar to the hair that she had, but alpha. <laughs> um, what else do I wanna do? Do I wanna give her some liner? She seems like an eyeliner kind of gal. An eyeliner kind of gal. And she also had like, I think it was this lip, was it? Wait, what lipstick was it? It was like this one, I think, in this color. That one's kind of cool. Maybe we should do that instead. I'm gonna put her in this, one of my favorite a CC outfits ever <laughs> and probably boots I would assume yeah 
Yeah, definitely. Oh no, Ren has the emotion bomb quirk now. Shoot. Hi, thanks for inviting me out. Luna, go home. Why are you at a nightclub being all pregnant and whatnot? Oh, she left. You invited us out and you leave. She's like, good thing I got this ball in my inventory. She's too much. Who do we got? Should we stay? Oof. Two people at the bar and a ghost dancing. Let's see what's going on upstairs. Oh, okay. Oh, Alice is here with Luna. Let's freaking go. Let's uh, dance battle pregnant Luna. Oh, wait, Reagan is here too. Let's ask her to be our bestie. Come on, sis. Let's dance battle. I'm just vibing over in the corner. Let me be. Let me be. Oh, 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 they're doing it. Sheesh, that was fast. Do you guys remember her though from our childhood? Cuties, we're gonna have to give her a makeover too. Oh, there they go. Alice is still wearing the same outfit I gave her when she lived in the household for New Year's Eve. Oh, you know what? They both maxed their dance skill. Oh no, she did it. I know that Luna did though. Everyone in our house is just like a very good dancer. Oh! Oh! Let's get it. Yeah. Oh my God. Keep in mind, she's pregnant. Dude! Holy crap! She served us. She absolutely served us. Okay, I think we probably lost. Caleb! He's dancing with his daughter. That's cute. Who is this man over here with the tattoos and the hair? And the snake bites? What? Tim Smith? Do we know you, Tim Smith? We don't. Why are you walking around looking like that though? You too. Trying to get me to act up or what? <laughs> we should introduce ourselves though. Just so like we can be friends, you know? Oh, she doesn't like the bubble machine. <gasps> oh, okay, let's get out of here then. Okay, okay. We out here. She's pissed about something. All right. Time to go. Person that we came here with just left us as soon as we got here. Probably an emergency. I'll give her the benefit of the doubt and say that it was an emergency and that she didn't just bail on us. Did you guys just see that notification? It's the, the it's almost Stella's time. Please make the most out of the last days one. I hate getting that one. Stella's not even gonna spend that much time in the house that we're gonna move them into. It's almost Stella's time. Make the most of these final days. How about no? How about you shut up? <laughs> All right, let's have this potion and start working on our breakthroughs because we got work to do. Scientists never sleep, you know? Let's do a playful painting. We actually do need a painting, a couple paintings for our collection still, don't we? Yeah, we only have playful, focused, sad, and s confident, flirty. We still need angry. Oh my gosh, girl. Can you please stop it with the ball? <laughs> you need to have your breakthroughs. I'm sorry. It is what it is. All right, y'all. Zoe just needs one more breakthrough. Just one more. Oh shoot, it's a holiday today. That means Stella, go to work. I definitely do want you to go to work even though it's a holiday, okay? I'm sorry, I need you to get promoted. Okay, so we need a cake for tonight. Oh, how I wish we could make themed cake in this game. That would be so fun. I guess we'll do a zombie cake. Uh, I forgot that we had that one. Yes, yes, yes! Oh, look, a trick-or-treater. <laughs> Oh, visionary of vases. A thousand dollars, Domec floral floor vase, a single rose. Why a single rose? What does that do? All right, time to party. Let's get that uh, potion of plentiful needs going for you, my love. Uh, Tina Tinker is an elder now, apparently. <laughs> 
Okay, we need to plan a social event too. What are you doing here? Get out of here, Tahiro. All right. Party starts now. Let's see what costume everyone puts on because they all should automatically put one on, right? Oh my god, why is Tina Tinker dying on our lot right now? Okay, we're taking this spooky party thing to a whole new level. <laughs> why? Why do Sims feel the freaking need to die on our lot, bro? Oh my god. She's like, hey neighbor, heard the sizzle of something broken. Okay, I'm gonna die now. <laughs> Stella, I love your costume. Uh, is that Kay? Hi, Kay. Look at Ren and Grim match. They are a match made in heaven. I mean, this is not how we wanted to greet our guests. Freaking Tina, dude! Get out of here! Oh my god. Now they're all gonna be sad at this part. Okay. Great! Michaela likes fishing. Who is Michaela? All right. Well, another one bites the dust. Let's just throw her in the graveyard, I guess. There you go. I'll fix it later. <laughs> okay. Where's y'all's costumes at? Is Grim just gonna kick it? He's like, ooh, a spooky party? Let's freaking go. I'll stay. All right, Zoe. What do you want to be? Um... Let's see, Grim Reaper. Let's do astronaut, it's pretty fitting. Um, Marnie, you can be Space Ranger. Oh, she's also uh, whatever this is, that Star Wars thing. Ren, you're a witch? Oh, that's Alice, cute. I love how whenever I have a party, um, these thingies just disappear. Oh my god, she actually went to our audition. <gasps> Luna's here and she's not pregnant anymore. And she's a cheerleader. Oh no, this girl's an elder already. Wow. Time is really flying. Let's get Lamar over here as well. Heck yeah, you look rad. I don't know how you're gonna hear him through your helmet, but all right. I love how Grim just decided to stick around for the spooky party. That makes me happy. Is this spooky music? Yeah, it is. Perfect. Who is this little love? Who are you? Oh, right! Melissa, you're Felix's other child. <gasps> Look! Oh my god, how cute is that? What the heck? I've never seen that before. That is adorable. Let me get this camera in here and see if it'll uh, cooperate with me. Share Halloween spirit. You need to be wearing a costume, my, my dude. Who is Darth Maul over here? Who are you? Felix, nice, love to see it. Love your costume. Oh, you still have your braces. <laughs> Picture's not working. I'm not surprised. Well, let's go ahead and get Ophelia to um, blow out the candles. Why, why are you napping in the bath? What's the matter? Oh. Oh man, okay. I'm just gonna cheat her, her energy because I need her to age up and be like, happy. <laughs> why is the mixologist just, just sitting here? Well, I'm happy to see people are eating the cheese eyeballs and the peach chips and salsa. Oh my ah, happy birthday! Oh my god, how cute! How cute is this? I'm obsessed, oh my god. Oh, little Yoda baby. Uh, oh my goodness, I am so nervous. Whoa, you aged up with a lot of nonsense. Holy crap, okay. Okay, let's open up our legacy trait thing. Let's go ahead and see what Ophelia's second trait is going to be and her adult aspiration. How exciting. The aspiration says like a lot about the Sim, I feel like. It kind of like 
gets the story going, you know? Their little storyline. Okay, let's see, let's see, let's see. Loves Outdoors and The Curator. Okay, that makes a lot of sense. That makes a lot of sense. So Ophelia is gonna be outside a lot, looking for looking for things, collecting things. This sim wants to collect everything the world has to offer. All right, love. Well, happy birthday. It's pretty dope that she aged up in a, in a costume already. <laughs> oh my gosh, oh my gosh. I'm so excited to give you a makeover, holy crap. Okay. It's pretty cool that everyone's dressed up, but everyone's just like standing there. Ah, <sighs> gosh. I think I need to take some of my CC out. It's like not even fun when they just stand around, you know? Someone made grilled cheese. All right, everybody. Thank you for coming to our spooky party. Thank you so much. <laughs> Next order of business is to give uh, give Miss Marnie a, not Marnie, Ophelia, a quick makeover and then move them out. And that will be it for today. Holy canola. Maybe I should like invite less people next time. Oh gosh, she got massive fanglings. <laughs> um, let's see here. Let's put some lashes on her. I guess I can kind of see it in the eyes now. I think it's just the lips that, that are throwing me off. Did Were Charlie's lips like that? I don't remember. I think this is the hair that I'm gonna go for. I think it looks really nice on her. Um, I think, right? Yeah, she looks so familiar. She looks like an actress, but I can't like put my finger on it. You guys are gonna have to help me. Okay, now let's find her something to wear. Uh, I don't even know like what style I want her to have. Oh, these are cute. Hold on a second. Ooh, oh my God, that is so freaking adorable. Okay, yeah. There's this shirt too, which has like little wildflowers on it. Aww. Okay. I love it. We might have to change the shoes though because it's like kind of clashing a bit. Oh my God, she's so beautiful. She's so beautiful. I just don't, I don't see the relation. She's definitely more Charlie than she is Stella, if anything, but like, I just don't, I don't see it. Oh my gosh, look at with the little jacket. It's like totally clipping in the back, but you can't even really tell. It's such a simple outfit, but it just, it looks really good on her. Okay, so the more that I look, maybe I do see Charlie. Look at this outfit. Oh, so cute. So, 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 so cute. <laughs> All right, you guys, she's all done. I hope that you like her. I, if you have any ideas, uh, like for a style, that you think would suit her well, just let me know in the comments and I may or may not change it. I just can't think of anything at the moment. I think that the last thing that we're gonna do is move everyone out, I think. I, the only reason why I'm hesitating is because I kinda want Stella's gravestone. Dang, dude. You are so beautiful. Wow. It's the eyes. I could see it in her eyes that she's definitely like the jeans. I could see it. I don't know. I guess. I don't know. I don't know. Anyways, y'all. I think it's time. I think it's time to move them out. And then um, we should spend her aspiration points as well on... What should we get? Should we just get a bunch of moodlet solvers? It's the only thing that she can like leave behind. <sighs> All right. This hurts my heart. My babies, they're leaving. I really hope I'm not forgetting anything. I don't want you guys to be like yelling at the screen right now. Like, Sav, don't forget, don't forget, don't forget. I probably am forgetting something, but it's fine. This is the little house that I placed. Perfect home. I don't even know how many bedrooms it is. 
I'm not ready to say goodbye, you guys. It's not really goodbye, but like, it's not even furnished. Maybe I can furnish it like on a stream someday, but I just found this on the gallery. It's a pretty cute family home. Goodbye, lovers. See you later. All right, I have moved them out of my played households. So, in the next episode, we are going to be with Zoe and Ren only. We are going to 100% focus on Zoe. Getting her to max her career, finishing her aspiration, getting married, and moving on to the next generation. Like, what? Thank you so much for watching. I hope that you guys enjoyed this episode. I love you so much, and I will see you in the next one. Bye! Mwah, 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 mwah!